G'day guys, in today's video I'm having a look at the Samsung Galaxy S21. This one's just the little the regular version. This is also the the Exynos version as well. And I've been trying out some emulation on there. And so far it's been pretty good. Pretty comparable to a Snapdragon 865 which is the processor in my POCO phone and gameplay wise I haven't really found much difference at all no real slowdown, no real lag like the other, stuff, the other emulator that I use is the Duck Station emulator and that one there has been replaying PS1 games flawlessly all while using the GameSir X2 Bluetooth version or version 2 Bluetooth and pretty much so far I reckon underground who has been probably one of the more demanding games that I've played on here and it handles it quite fine and if I just load up some other games so for example we'll go Tony Hawk Underground As you can see, plays that reasonably good as well. If I go and current goal, go back to the actual world. As you can see, frame rate's holding reasonably well. Do I? We are getting some texture pop. Overall, a fairly playable game. I don't have a quick save for this one, sorry guys. And one more. So we go Metal Gear Solid. Which I thought I had a quick save for. No. Sorry guys. Anyway, performance on here I found to be fairly decent. So if you're looking at the Exynos version of the, of the Samsung Galaxy S21, it's still quite decent in emulation. So I don't reckon there's really much concern if you get the Snapdragon or the Exynos. It's still a pretty damn decent phone for emulation. And I hope this helps you. Bye.